How's it going, YouTube? Today is uh, Sunday, March 4th, 2011, and the top of this video is going to be Should restaurants and other entities such as commercial airlines have kid-free zones? Um, this topic was inspired by a conversation on a internet message board that I post on, and um, to be honest with you, I'm kind of got mixed feelings on the subject. Um, I have a two-year-old nephew, and for the most part, with some incredibly rare exceptions, he's very well-behaved in public. So, um, I would, you know, I would welcome restaurants to not have kid-free zones because, for the most part, it's pretty much accepted that people bring their kids to restaurants, but I can understand the other side of the issue that, you know, sometimes you want to go out to a really nice restaurant and not be bothered by a little kid who's just running around or making a huge fuss. In generally in nicer restaurants, they don't really bring, people don't bring little kids with some exceptions. I know my mom once went to a really nice German restaurant with a friend and there was a little kid who was just making making a huge scene out of everything um so yeah I think that absolutely it, it shouldn't be it, it shouldn't be I know there's some restaurants that do have kid free zones and you know my my uh, opinion on that is you know private business their business their rules so um but yeah, I can understand the frustration of people when they, you know, go to a restaurant and they're expecting to have a good time and wondering, you know, why there's little kids just running around making a huge mess. As far as commercial flights go, I went to Denver from Chicago on one a couple months ago, and basically wound up sitting next to a little kid and first I was kind of dreading it alone I'm like oh no I have no idea how this kid's going to react to being on an airplane and for the most part it was actually good I think if I remember correctly I gave him one of my candy bars or something that I had in my bag um because I brought along a huge bag of like granola bars and candy and stuff like that because I was going to be sitting on a plane for the majority of my takes, I was flying from Chicago to Denver, and then from Denver to Burbank, California, and I was going to be either on the plane or transferring all day. <laughs> so, um, I think, you know, I think, you know, it should be up to the airlines, but, you know, there's two sides to this. It's, you know, some kids behave well while on planes, some don't, some just don't know how to do discipline. So, um, basically, to the end of it, I don't think that restaurants and commercial entities should absolutely put in kid-free zones unless they absolutely want to, and then people have that decision as to whether or not they want to patronize that business. I do feel, however, that some businesses should be family-friendly. Like, for example, sporting events. I think that sporting events like baseball stadiums and the like should have family zones where they don't serve alcohol because I go to like Bears games and White Sox games and yes if anybody is watching from Chicago I do like the White Sox so haters gonna hate. But yeah, I just like I go to a White Sox game and I see like people just getting sloshed drunk with their kids and I'm like, really? It's like you're really gonna do that? Or it's just I you know, I'm not a huge drinker, I'm not really a drinker at all, and I think that they should just have sections of the stadium where it's family and no liquor should be sold or brought into those sections. Um this because, you know, it's just really embarrassing and just irritating to be sitting at a stadium trying to enjoy yourself and you just got some drunk idiot, a couple of 
throws away or something, just making him making a total fool of himself. Like one of the last Bears games I went to was a game where I was sitting like two rows from the top. I'm talking in the cheap seats, nosebleed section, and this one and these two uh this was like the row in front of me some a couple of Rams fans walked in. They were playing the St. Louis Rams, by the way. And these t c couple other people in this section were just screaming all kinds of obscenities towards the Rams fans. Just, I was, I was just embarrassed. Like, what the heck, you know? Just, you know, these really awful obscenities. And I could tell they were drunk. It's like, you know, come on. So yeah, that's all I got. Don't think that restaurants should have kids sections or commercial entities unless they really want to and they should make family friendly sections at places such as baseball games. So yeah, thanks for watching.